Hello friends, hope you are doing great. In this video, I will show you how to create an AWS S3 bucket by using uh, AWS SDK 2.0. Um, the AWS SDK 2.0 is a major rewrite over SDK version 1.x. It is built on top of um, it is built on top of Java 8 and have lots of extra features that were missing in AWS uh, SDK version 1.x. Okay. So let's create. So let's uh, in my AWS S3 uh, account. There is only one bucket currently. So let's create an, the another one. Okay. So if you see my form.xml, um, I am using a version 2.10 for the AWS SDK. Okay. So first of all, we need to create an S3 client. So for S3 client, there is a new way to create. Okay, this is the default uh, S3 client. So this client will take the credentials and region that are configured in my AWS CLI. Okay, so the credentials and region I have already provided while configuring my AWS CLI. So this will take the credentials by using a default uh, credential provider chain and region by uh, default AWS region provider chain. Okay. So for creating the bucket, there is a new uh, class that is create a bucket request. Let's create an object of this. So this majorly requires the bucket name. The bucket name is let's say uh, yes. Okay. and the rest all fields can be the default one okay so to create an s3 bucket we need to call this by using the client so uh, this is the uh, final uh, call that we need to make oh, okay but later uh, but let's put it in a try catch block because the bucket name need to be globally unique so if the bucket name already exists then we get an exception okay so let's have a okay so the program is now complete so let's run this Yeah, the program runs successfully. Let's see our S3 bucket. And yeah, the bucket is now created and it will be an empty bucket. Yeah, for sure. So this is um, like how to create an S3 bucket by using AWS SDK 2.0. In my next video, in my next video, I will show you how to create a file and delete a file from S3. Okay. If you like this video, please subscribe to the channel and Bye-bye.